Hey, welcome back. We're in the Gospel of Luke. We're all the way up to chapter 6 now. And let's look at verses 17 to 19. Here we go. It's talking about Jesus. And he came down with them and stood on a level place with a crowd of his disciples and a great multitude of people from all Judea and Jerusalem and from the seacoast of Tyre and Sidon who came to hear him and be healed of their diseases, as well as those who were tormented with unclean spirits and they were healed. And the whole multitude sought to touch him, for power went out from him and healed them all. So here we have Jesus coming down. He's going to give some stuff here that's pretty much Sermon on the Mount type stuff uh, coming up starting tomorrow morning. But notice here the people are from all over. They're gathered around. They have come to hear him and to be healed. Some people think we should just do healing. We should just meet people at their felt needs. So yeah, let's take care of all their... And we should work on those felt needs. But notice here that people weren't just here to receive their felt needs. They were here to hear Jesus. They were here to hear the teaching, the teaching from heaven. And so it's a very good thing. And people want teaching. People want sound teaching. And you and I, because God has given us the word and we can compare scripture with scripture, we can understand, study closely in each each passage all the way through, God can use you and I to help people have a good understanding of his word. And so don't neglect the teaching. Don't neglect the teaching. And uh, the third thing I was going to say was, if you're a Christian, don't neglect the teaching. Jesus didn't neglect it either. Let's pray. Dear Father in heaven, at the moment I'm filming this, it's storming outside, but it's storming on planet earth. And we look to you, Lord, you can help us you can come down and teach us and heal everyone who wants to be healed. So, Lord, now use us to help with all these felt needs things, but also, Lord, use us to, to faithfully and correctly teach from the Bible. With your help, we can do it. We thank you for hearing our request for your help. In Jesus' name, amen. Friend, God bless you today in all of your teaching.